Our live audience today is here to tell us about the easiest way that you can fight hunger in Hampton Roads, and it is this weekend with the National Association of Letter Carriers Stamp Out Hunger Food Drive. And here now to tell us all about it and how it works and how you can participate is Abby Weber from the Food Bank of Southeastern Virginia. Abby, all of you, welcome to the Hampton Roads Show. Thank you for having us. I'm all about this food drive. It's easy. You don't have to get out of, leave your home, go right to your mailbox. No, it could not be more simple. Um, on Saturday, May 10th, this coming Saturday, people can just put out a bag of non-perishable food donations, mm -hmm. and their trusty letter carrier will pick it up for them. And is there a limit on how much you can set up? No, no. Um, some people will be receiving these um, blue bags. They can go ahead and fill that up with okay. food. But if they have multiple bags, that's fine. Some people will be receiving a reminder postcard, mm -hmm. and they can fill up however many grocery bags they have. We're happy to accept anything. And this is kind of like a little contest is it between the letter carriers yeah so in our area well, friendly competition we have a competition between <laughs> our postal stations so we have a big traveling trophy mm -hmm. at the end um, and the winning station gets that big trophy and the bragging rights for the next year and it's a great cause it's also a great way to to sprinkle them because you said summer is kind of the time where you don't get as many donations absolutely as you would. after the holiday season donations really drop from for us from the community so as we head into the summer months and the kids are out of school families are struggling a little more um, and we don't have as many donations coming Coming in this Saturday really is the chance for us to stock our shelves and supply our agencies with food to get through that time. And when you say non-perishable, some people may not know exactly what that means and what they can put out, like cans and dry foods, and also check those expiration dates. Exactly. If people can check food. their dates, if it's mm -hmm. years old, we can accept that. Um, but if it's dry goods, canned, boxed, and we're really looking for nutritious items. Okay. So just take a look at what you're giving us, and we really want to feed people um, healthy items. What is your favorite item that you guys receive and that every we, time? it comes through you're like yes yes we love <laughs> high protein items so gotcha. peanut butter canned tuna mm -hmm. those are always great and canned fruits and vegetables are wonderful staples as well and when it all comes back to the food bank are there like trucks loaded with food and just probably makes you guys feel great that the community has come together to, to do something we like this. love it we love watching all that food <laughs> roll in um, last year between the two food banks in our area it was over 150,000 meals so wow. we love watching that food come in and we work with the um, postal service transportation as well as our trucks to get it all in there and it's it's a great day for and us. letter carriers are already awesome but now they're even more awesome because now they're helping the community, picking up those non-perishable items. If people miss this on Saturday, they can't get those foods out. They can always, always, anytime come down and just bring it straight to the food bank. Absolutely. And if they don't want to do that, you can always donate funds online okay. um, to either of the food bank's websites. It's always really easy. And then we can purchase food with those funds. Sounds good. And do you prefer it being in a box or a bag if they leave it out or it just doesn't matter? Um, either. I think bags. Yeah, yeah ask the letter carriers. They're the ones that have to carry. Bags. <laughs> All right, bags it is. National Association of Letter Carriers Stamp Out Hunger Food Drive is this Saturday, May 10th. For more information, you can go to Food Bank of Southeastern Virginia. Foodbankonline.org is the website, and the Food Bank of the Virginia Peninsula, hrfoodbank.org. Abby, all of you, thanks for being here. Thank you for having Thank us. You.